why he was happy. Why did you want to farm? Why was that the career you chose? The best job there is. There's uh, um, your own boss. You work out in the in in outside in creation, and you get to work on machinery that it's adapting all the time. You have to do never get bored because there's always something from <laughs> planting in the spring to harvesting, uh, taking care of the finances and taking care of the varieties that you are in control of a very creative process and you make things. Mm -hmm. And so uh, I was surrounded by family that did it and there was nothing else I wanted to do. <laughs> so I know you started college at LSU. What do you see as the relationship between formal education and farming? Or is there a relationship? Oh, uh, certainly it, it takes a, uh, a lot of knowledge to be a good farmer, but sometimes you have to be really precise in applying it. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to constantly experiment and it's very nice to have the help of uh, people who can, uh, do, uh, as, at the state level, develop varieties and do do certain things. But uh, my grandmother always said she, one of her brothers went to college and it ruined him as a farmer <laughs> because he was too idealistic to uh, do the very practical work of uh, getting putting a crop in and coming out at the end of end of it with more money. So uh, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so yeah, there were some very tough times to get by when the, you you made a crop on next to nothing. You yeah. go to the little all fields in South Louisiana and put all in a barrel and you'd scrape every grease off the bottom and use the oil and mm -hmm. burn everything in your tractor you possibly could and you get that barrel all for 20 cents mm -hmm. and you could put in a crop for next to nothing and sell it when times are really tough. You had to be adaptable mm -hmm. to get so through. So why did you stop farming? Money. Uh, modern life is much more expensive. We can do so many things but you need benefits and uh, it's very unpredictable. Uh, the price did not rise nearly as much because there was so much supply from the world uh, and from other places that were more productive. We're very close to the Gulf. Mm -hmm. We're a high mm -hmm. uh, risk area. Salt water, hurricanes, uh, thin soil, the clay that helps the water stay on the fields. We're at the thin topsoil, so it's not that productive a land. Mm -hmm. So, Do you miss farming? Yes. <laughs> All the time? <laughs> uh, I'm happy that I was able to go in oil field and make a living. Uh, and I'm still associated, I'm still happy that I have still a few family that farm and uh, able to live there and, and mm -hmm. stay in touch. Mm 